Hello everyone, welcome to Halo Moon Tarot. This is your uh, weekly reading for Gemini. How are you guys? Hope you're all doing well. And Gemini, thanks for dropping in. If you're looking for a singles love reading, please check out my playlist. I put them up every Monday. And this reading is general, any aspect of your life. Take it how it best resonates. So I see a leg up. Ooh, soulmates. This is two people building each other up, helping each other out. Very nice. This could be just a friendship as well. And I see some kind of break or taking a little bit of a nap here. You can see someone here taking a little bit of a snooze. So you could be on a break from somebody. Okay, or it is two people helping each other out. Someone may be helping someone so they can take a little rest. We shall see. Gemini. Gemini need to know with this overall energy clarity please for Gemini do they need to know oops take those so I do see the chariot beautiful full steam ahead heading down another path so this is moving towards success staying in control of those emotions beautiful it's about reining it in right emotional control going down a new path teamwork so there's some teamwork cooperation compromise this is beautiful full steam ahead things are speeding up i see something new beautiful so the sun is shining there's something new this could be two people going down a path together after a little break a little pause it could even be just going on a vacation to someplace sunny maybe just a drive on a sunny day yeah, going to another community. So I see friends and family, good news, some kind of connection. So some of you may meet somebody new. Now this could be a collaboration. Uh, you may be traveling, you may meet someone, but it's about controlling your emotions, okay? Staying on course, full steam ahead. So I see you moving towards success here. You got a person who wants to have success with you. I can see it. I see a Cancer energy, I see a Leo. Uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Now this could be yourself, Gemini. You know, thinking clearly here, doing some thinking. This could be a strategy as well, you know, some kind of celebration or event here. Something is about to happen. See someone very wise, very logical, not being ruled by their feelings and emotions. This could be a person coming in, you know. They may want to start something. They may approach you when you're out with your friends or family or somewhere out in the community. Uh, they may be wanting to express themselves or start something. Gemini. Does Gemini need to know? Oh, uh, yes. This is someone here who's definitely not ruled by their emotion. This is someone who, it's an energy of, you know, somebody who chooses their battles, making a choice. This is somebody who uh, possibly is a little indecisive because of the way the card's facing. It's pointing at it, but it's someone who's becoming clear. Okay, it's time to go down a new path towards someone or a situation that's more successful. This could be some advice for some of you not to rush. Okay, I feel like there's not a lot of rush here. Okay, but it's an energy of somebody wanting to communicate, choosing their battles, choosing their words. Yeah, well, this is somebody very wise and logical. They like to communicate, probably like to talk a lot. And I see a king of cups. Yeah, this is definitely a person in their feelings and their emotions. So I see a connection between two people and I see emotional fulfillment. Oh my goodness. I see two people on the same page who get each other. See the Hierophant. This could be uh, some kind of contract negotiation, something to do with community. Uh, but it's about the way someone conducts themselves. So we've got someone here. It's how they're conducting themselves, emotionally available and mature. It's an energy of someone who's taking a nap, clearing things out of their life. Okay, clearing things up and getting ready to start something new. This is really, really positive. I see a lot of happiness. Two people putting all the cups on the table, putting themselves out there, talking, negotiating, getting on the same page. So someone who may be checking you out, they're not rushing, watching the way you conduct yourself. Okay. Um, when you're kind of out in the community around your friends and family, um, but it's definitely someone logical, very wise quite strategic, sort of someone who plans. So they think first before they speak. <laughs> Tell me about this chariot. 
So I see bread, a period of prosperity and abundance. Yeah, so it has to do with success. Wow. Is this someone who wants to have success? They could be very wise, intelligent. They could be a teacher, a lawyer. You know, I see the Hierophant, someone who's an educator, very definitely emotional and mature. It's a person who you know, sometimes a little cautious, okay, about offering themselves their feelings and emotions, about putting themselves out there. It's a bit of a habit. It's the way they conduct themselves, you know, the way they were raised. So it's quite interesting. Tell me about the three of pentacles there we go so we have an older man so this is someone mature they could be older but there could be someone just mature dealing or relationship with an older man this is someone compatible ready to go down a new path if they're not ruled see they're mature they're not ruled by their emotions but they're emotional so very nice energy really you don't want someone who rushes in and you know just throws themselves you know at you this is somebody who's careful they think before they speak yeah so i do see new the sun shining a lot of happiness a little help somebody could be offering you a helping hand okay you could have something going on there's some kind of an event but it's a leg up it's that little bit of a boost yeah this is two people helping each other We may be offering you a helping hand too with something we'll see here tell me about the sun there we are so i see love and the dragon beware of self-delusion yeah so this is an energy of someone who's being aware of self-delusion they're not rushing into anything you see very wise choosing their battles so i don't think this person has a whole lot of delusions there's a lot of wisdom now, this person could be even someone younger who's very wise for their years Tell me about the leg up. There we go. Uh, so there it is. Success assured with good plan. So this is someone who's planning ahead, thinking about how to communicate. They're going to approach you. Uh, they're coming in. This is somebody who may have rushed into a relationship before. So it's likely someone who's learned the school of hard knocks. Uh, I see a little Taurus energy. Yeah. Success assured with good fortune and hard work. This is someone who definitely, uh, you know, worked on themselves, but it has something to do with work, okay? Something to do with the nest egg, building a nest, something successful. So we'll see. I may ask some more questions on that. So there we have a dark woman. So I see a dark haired woman. So dealing with a relationship with a woman with dark complexion or dark hair. There's some kind of success. This is someone who wants to have success. Definitely not ruled by their emotions. Okay, so it's telling you as well here. Don't be ruled by your emotions. Okay, I see success coming in, things moving. Yeah, I think you got something good, really good happening here. Some of you might have a choice between a couple people too. Uh, you may be kind of in your head a little bit yourself. Um with this leg up needing a little helping hand it has to do with uh, the success of something here uh, i see an agreement a handshake so some kind of negotiation or contract here okay it's just two people i feel with the hierophant here uh, helping each other out so some kind of handshake some kind of meeting this could be a stranger someone you could meet with a stranger an older man okay could bet this person on online dating social media or someplace out in your community it's a happy place a friendly place so you could meet someone here it could be someone offering you something too so i see a temporary situation so it's something temporary oh, i should actually go here that's where i was talking so this is someplace temporary or a, a temporary situation so it's nothing permanent okay as far as uh, work or something to do with success uh, and I see a ladder. So yeah, it's a ladder to success. This thing's clearing up here, clearing things out. It has to do with something new. Uh, you can see the sun rising. So I have, it's, it's climbing the ladder to success. Some kind of negotiation. This is very happy. Here's, you know, it feels like some kind of celebration or get together. Uh, it says, I think you got a person who's planning something and I feel like you're going to get some kind of an invitation. You may have a couple people here, though, like I say, and it has to do with 
uh, teaming up, teamwork. Now, it could be a boss. Some of you, there could be some work situation here, too. And it has to do with creativity. Uh, and there's a need for cooperation where two people need to cooperate. Maybe compromise will be needed here. But there's a new love here. I can see love. It's also an energy of doing something you love, Gemini. Uh, and I can see the grapes. Yeah, enjoying the fruits of one's labor. It's time to get out and have fun. So it's an energy of getting out. Someone's strategizing. They want to get out and have fun. They want to take a break, maybe from work. Uh, you might rush into the, uh, run into this person if you're out for lunch with uh, maybe your boss or work colleagues, colleagues here. But I do see new, okay? I see the sun rising, a new creative idea, new ventures. So, uh, but definitely it's related to the sun energy. And I do see love up there. You will be taken care of in diff difficult times. Oh yeah, this is definitely someone who uh, is going to take care of something. You got a person who's going to take care of something here for you. They're going to give you a leg up. They're going to help you out. It's just temporary. Uh, some of you could be filling out for somebody in a job place that's temporary as well, lending a helping hand yourself. But we got someone here taking care of business, being very wise. And there's someone who thinks before they speak, they choose their battles, like I said. Um, and I see that soulmate. So this could be just a friend. Okay, it could be a family friend, someone in your social circle or your community. Uh, I see September. So we are in September now. So this could be something that's happening. This could be a birth date of this person or the time of the month they were born. Um, but I do see Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I do see uh, September would be uh, Virgo and Libra, possibly. But it's something in September about not rushing. There's no rush, I feel, with something. Tell me about soulmates. So I do, yeah. Whatever it is that you were planning, something you planned from the past is about to bring you success with the dolphin. And you can see the sun shining. I see a lot of playful fun, having a good time. I feel like it's going to happen in September. Some of you are going to meet a new person. Uh, maybe you've already met them. I feel like there's a couple of things going on. Uh, something possibly with work. Something about driving a new path. Hmm. Some of you may take a different way to work and you could actually meet somebody if you stop someplace in the community. Interesting. All right, King of Cups, why are you here for Gemini? Why is the King of Cups here for Gemini? I see wind chimes. I see peace and harmony. Ooh, friendship, two people coming together. We got two people drinking from each other's cup here. I feel like you're going to get offered a date, okay? I feel there's something else to do with work here, and it has to do with financial success, but it's a period of prosperity. So I feel like you're filling in for somebody, uh, something temporary, okay? Yeah, because I actually feel there's another person here. <laughs> In fact, there may be several others. Uh, but this is the soulmate connection. Uh, this King of Cups. So let's see, what is this Two of Cups about? Uh, I see the pin, new job, new career, connecting, like-minded, being on the same page, two people getting each other. This could be someone you work with. It could turn into something more, okay? Okay. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Tell me about the 10. There we are. So now we have October. So there's something happening in October. So this is the leaves falling. It's the release of something. You see the leaves are falling. So something to do with October. There's a lot of emotional fulfillment. It has to do with a new job or career. Something tempor temporary could turn into something permanent as far as work. Okay, because you're going to connect with someone here. There's going to be some kind of... Now, this could be an agreement on the side. <laughs> something to do with climbing the ladder to success. It has something to do with other people or in the community. I see a lot of great happiness in October. And I see changes in your life, the moon, to do with habits, the way you conduct yourself, the way you live. Uh, could be anything. But look at that. I see peace and harmony. Great harmony. This could be some kind of musical event as well. There could be somebody planning something. Uh, and I do feel it's a really, really positive. So something started in December and it's going to play out in October. 
possibly okay I see the moon changes in your life could be a little bit of fear okay you might be a little afraid of the unknown here release that negative energy it looks like some kind of a break taking a little nap um, taking a little bit of a rest could be a trip or a vacation too you know some of you uh, working somewhere in a temporary situation tell me about time for a nap where did that go let me just flip these the other way there we go there was two there <clears throat> so we have the valley deep personal strength and peace that causes that assures success see clearing out negative energy clearing things out um i see this valley so there's definitely something deep here some kind of connection is is going to develop and I feel it has to do with two people and some kind of negotiation is going to bring you a lot of happiness. It's two people being on the same page. Um, I see recognition, reward for merit. Wow. It's a basket. Could be a gift basket, things like that too. But this valley is interesting because it's very deep personal strength. Uh, so someone who may see your strength. Uh, I do see something personal. This could be a personal friend too. Or it's it's an energy of... Uh, two people here being on the same page, putting all the cups out there. Two people making each other happy here. I mean, you have a choice between two, two as well. There could be a little bit of fear of change here, but I actually feel it's uh, just that break, that nap, that getting things clear, clearing things out. Whatever it is you've been doing, success is about to pay off. I love this so much. You're getting rewards for something. Okay, now I don't know if you're working somewhere temporary and you're doing so well that someone's really watching you and thinking, um, you know, gaining some kind of clarity here. Um, it's like it's an energy of you will be taken care of. So someone's going to take care of something. You're either taking care of something for someone and they're really appreciative of it or you've done it in the past or did it in September and now it's going to pay off for something. If you were, like I say, it feels like a temporary job turning into permanent. Some of you, there is a, a new beginning. So we're, beware of self-delusion, okay? But I feel that's the energy of someone who's definitely very clear, very wise. They're not delusional, okay? There's some kind of truth and clarity. So just, I feel it's this person, this older man. Very cooperative, very creative, okay? It's about going down the path. So let's see who this older man is. Who is this person? So, uh, pleasure with a close friend so they could be a close friend someone who wants to team up uh, they could be giving you a leg up helping you with something um, and I see a funnel period of frustration yeah so if you're really frustrated with something uh, you're struggling with something creative uh, you've got this person who's going to help you out here so rest assured you're not alone you'll be taken care of someone's going to take care of something for you but I feel maybe in return you're going to do something for them it could be a vice versa though so the nest, an emotionally secure, loving family is important to you. So I do feel like there's other things. I see meeting someone new, something new starting, the sun shining. Okay, yeah. You might be a little bit worried, you know, that you have, if you have a love situation going on, you may have somebody who's older and more mature here. Uh, so be very careful if you do start something with someone. It, you know, I do see it's possible there could be something temporary okay so make sure you get the clarity you need because i do see someone who's you know at some point in september is a little indecisive but it's about becoming decisive becoming clear see it's like the fog is lifting and that's that moon energy i feel regardless you're going to move towards peace and harmony some kind of financial game usually coming from something you did in the past but it could be something emotional uh, uh, you know or you've got a, two situations going on yeah, I see an April energy, so this could be Aries, um, Taurus energy, something about spring, okay, the dolphin, something playful, oh yeah, there's definitely something playful, having a good time, because that energy is here, the ladder to success, some kind of new idea, creative adventure, and uh, time to go out and have fun. I think you got a person who's strategizing something fun, they're planning something. Now, it could be because you did something nice for them at some point. They're going to do something nice in return. It really could be that simple. 
Oh, tell me about the wind chimes. This is somebody who's very peaceful, very kind, uh, very gentle. Wind chimes, okay? This is this person's personality, peace and harmony. And uh, yeah, between two people. Two people on the same page drinking from each other's cup. I see communication between two people. So a very peaceful, uh, kind, considerate uh, kind of energy. This is a person who shows they care. So uh, yeah, they could be anyone. But it is possible it's Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. Could be even the King of Swords, you know, that person with that emotional energy. Yeah, like I say, it could all be one person. But I feel like there's two things going on. So, tell me about the pin, the new job, new career, new love interest. Yeah, so there's some kind of protection, spiritual guidance, protection from harm. Someone's going to look out for you. You got someone here, I feel. Now, you may have someone. Watch out for someone who wants to start something. Make sure they have your best interest. I do have to warn you just a little. I do see a little negativity with um, somebody here. So, just a little caution that someone has your best interest. I'm sure you have someone here isn't strategizing, you know, just having a good time. Uh, that playful kind of energy, youthful. Make sure that whoever comes towards you is mature. So I feel like you've got someone here who's mature. Somebody may not be, but I can't really see for sure because I, the King of Swords can be strategic. So somebody who's, you know, maybe you've had someone who's rushed in and out. So watch that energy of starting something new with anyone rushing in and out. So make sure anyone who comes in, they do have your best interest. Yeah, I do see the handshake, though, with a person. That's why I feel the older man could be a love interest for some of you. But for others of you, I feel this is somebody maybe a little fatherly, uh, just helping you out with something temporary. And I do see a fan. Yeah, no, it's somebody who's a fan. So, yeah. And I also see, look at that energy, a fan. So uh, this is romance, celebration, or a party. I think you got a person here who's, um, there's some kind of overall energy of someone who's admiring something you're doing. They're watching you, how you conduct yourself. And I feel romance here. So it could be romance or some kind of celebration or party here. Someone's planning something. Kind of, this is definitely, you know, the fan is somebody who admires someone. Um, doing a lot of thinking. Tell me about September. Why is September here? What's going to happen exactly in September? Give us some clarity, please. Uh, I see a vine. Seek out information that will help you. <laughs> through you, you may hear something through the grapevine. You may have to ask someone else. <laughs> yeah. I think it's someone seeking out information about you. So I see the elephant. Long journey, either physical, mental, will leave you wiser. This is someone very wise. See, it's someone who's not rushing into anything too quick. I, like I said, I feel this is someone who's choosing their words, choosing their battle. Uh, but this is someone who will act. They will act and react when they're ready. Very confident, when they're confident with that lion. So I do see a little Leo energy there. And I can see a flag. So don't be tempted to lower your standards, okay? And now that was here. That's this person. If someone is checking you out, how you conduct yourself, how you behave. Now it could be yourself as well. This is someone who won't, you know, has its energy of rushing in and rushing out. So it could be a message for you not to lower your standards. But I think it's this person, high standards, a fan. Someone's admiring your high standards, I feel. Uh, especially if it's in the workplace, but if it is at a party, a celebration, there, someone here is checking out how you conduct yourself. Um, so I do see it has to do with success, um, and I do see this person looking for some kind of clarity before they communicate with you. Let's see what the outcome of this situation is for Gemini. Yeah, there's something unknown here, okay? And so I feel unknown if this person's married. Uh, I see a little bit of change here. Where well, this card is a little different. It has to do with change. Someone may have a little fear of change. But I actually see the harp in October. That transformation. you got transformation coming. It's really, really positive. Oh, no. 
So there it is. Chaos and conflict. There may be obstacles and challenges. So a little bit of fear of chaos and conflict, obstacles and challenges here. Someone might be a little concerned checking you out if you have people around you, if there's competition as well. But I feel like it's energy of something that's going to be left behind here because the recognition reward for it merit. So this is an energy to the sea, moving forward calmly and peacefully. Uh, some of you are moving away from someone to avoid a disaster, taking the lessons you've learned, the school of hard knocks. Uh, but this is also an energy of someone figuring something out. you got to someone who's figuring out their feelings. And they're trying to figure out if there's competition as well. I think you have a love interest here. In fact, I feel like there's a few people around you um, that are definitely seeing something to do with success with you. I see building a nest, a nest egg. Uh, emotional security, financial stability, uh, especially to do with love. Could be doing something you love, starting something new that's creative. There's an older man who's going to give you a leg up. Could be some financial support too. So I see building. So there's an energy of building. So it's an energy of working very hard. Something you worked for is going to bring you the basket, recognition, reward, and merit. So uh, wherever you are in this, uh, there's always a message for people, even if it's something simple about working really hard, doing your due diligence, and being really wise. Okay, because whatever it is, you're going to be recognized for something. Uh, and you are you have someone here who's you'll be taking care of. Someone's gonna someone's looking out for your best interest here. And I feel like someone is very protective of you. This is that King of Cups you see. Peace and harmony. This is someone who can restore peace and harmony. Very calm, very patient kind of person. <laughs> very nice. One more card for Gemini. There we are. So it's about observing. Someone is observing you, but it's also they're observing their feelings. Someone's trying to figure out their feelings. Or maybe they're trying to figure out if you have feelings for someone else. Okay. But you have someone who's very protective of you. And I do see, but I do see spiritual guidance, the angels protecting you and this, this union. Uh, and as I do see the community. So there's definitely a community energy. Uh, this is definitely, um, wow. So someone around you, in your social circle, friend of a family, or just somewhere around you in your community. And maybe you haven't met them yet, or you have. And, uh, it's something that maybe didn't last or, it, you know, you felt it was temporary. But I would be surprised if you hear from this person. Um, I do see September and then October. So we're very close to October. And it has definitely has to do with, oh, yeah, teamwork, cooperation, going down a new path. Uh, compatibility, cohabitating, someone compatible in your community. Like I say, it could be working with someone too. It's going to be different for each of you, but wow. But I definitely see some romantic energy here too. There's enough cards to show. There's something, behind, someone here um, doing some thinking about they're not rushing in. <laughs> you see? No, they're going to make sure they know. This is definitely someone who has high standards. I can tell you that right now. They see you the way you conduct yourself. You have high standards. Yeah, beautiful energy. Take care. I wish you the very best, Gemini, and we'll see you soon.